What up, motherfuckers? The Stealth Experience. With the plane, bro. And today we're doing something different. <laughs> Fuck these planes. Number one. Three hours later. So, as you can see, we're outside, living life, you know? We saw some cars for the shot. And another thing that we're doing different today is we have a special guest. He's one of the most famous YouTubers <laughs> around. His name is Rodrigo. What up, Rodrigo? What's up, Bruce? How I are mean, you doing, big boy? Good, good. I mean, do you guys have your own chairs? You guys don't. This oh, is shit, how you you're welcome right. your guest. What, what... All right, Rodrigo, give a few words about yourself. Well, I, it's an honor to I be mean, sitting here between you guys. I mean, to be honest, I've never seen any of your videos. You just asked me to come. <laughs> oh, yeah. Edit that out <laughs> real quick. So here's the big boy right here. How many subscribers do you have? I'm at 125 subs 125,000 subscribers. Right now. <laughs> All right, it's about 124,000 more than us. Get some change. Um, We got a celebrity up in here. So, what do you guys do with these plane noises? We shoot them down. <laughs> Alright, so what, what, what's going on, basically? Go I, appreciate, I appreciate you guys inviting me to do this, uh, be part of the channel. I've heard good things. Um, so, what do you do? What do you do for YouTube? For YouTube, I'm basically a vlogger, so I record my own life. As this video is shooting right now, I actually have a person behind the camera shooting me and recording a behind the scenes of how these guys do it. So if you guys want to actually see that, you can click um, down below, somewhere, somewhere, somewhere down page. below, somewhere you can click page. the it's link. Right and this, this, this video will be out in my channel before this video is out on their channel. So oh, by the time a, that you see this, it's you a can, dick measuring competition now. <laughs> I guess we're, you can see it down in below in the box. You can see the description. Go check me out and um, yeah, man, I appreciate you guys bringing me here. Awesome, awesome. Let's, let's get, get into it. Let's get, let's let's get some it. beers, grab the beers. Okay. So today, what do we have, Janice, today? We have the Royal Jamaican. Royal Product Jamaica. Jamaica. You wanna show them All right. the little logo? Let's, let's bring it in a little bit. Ooh, sexy. All right, cool, cool. So Rodrigo, just from like the looks of it, what do you think it's gonna taste like? Just from, you know, like the color, the palm trees, stuff like that. Like, what do you think it's I feel, gonna I feel like? like it's gonna be a little bit fruity. You know, yeah. It's Jamaica, it's Royal Jamaican. Everything I've, any drink I've ever had, and it says ginger beer, there you so go. alcoholic ginger beer, which I don't know. I mean, this mm -hmm. is pretty cool. Like, and yeah, this no. is the first time both of you've ever drank this beer, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay, so I'm not every, the first. Every time first we drink, it's okay. a beer. It's a new one. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm not a big uh, beer drinker, but I'm excited to try this out, man. Did you just try it on Squirt? Yeah, yeah. yeah we don't know those beers on this channel. Those are yeah. pussy beers. Yeah, those are pussy beers. <laughs> Oh, you guys have the. So, how do you guys do this? Well, today we have. I don't know what this is, but. A wait, hold oh, on. Wait, what about you? What do you think it's gonna drink like? Oh, okay. What it's like, gonna sorry. drink? <laughs> yeah, it tastes like. It's gonna drink like. Like ginger. I don't know what ginger is. Why like. would you steal my answer? <laughs> <laughs> well, it does say fucking ginger on there like three times. Yeah. Um, what about you, Jens? Do you think it's what gonna, gonna have a sour. T I mean, I'm trying to think about it. I, wh what's a ginger drink like? Ginger ale? We're gonna see today. Yeah. What do you think, Jazz? What about me? Mm, yeah, I mean, I have to agree with Rodrigo right here. Like, from like the yellow color, I think it's gonna be like a little citrusy. Okay. Right? Maybe a little hint of orange. I don't know what ginger is. Like, what, 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 what <laughs> no, is it? Yeah. Like, I don't either. Is it like, a, like a fruit? Ginger. Whatever. All I can think about is ginger ale. A little bit fruity. <laughs> Yeah, like a little fruity. What percentage of alcohol is 4.4, so it is a lighter side beer. Yeah. Okay, so it might have a sweet taste to it. But at the same time... Don't okay. don't let that fool you. We've yeah. tasted like 8% that are like the smoothest thing you've ever tasted. Really? Like yeah. water, almost. It's Jeez. insane. So, yeah, it's pretty dangerous. <laughs> yeah, you never know what you're drinking <laughs> out here in the streets. You should have told me before I drove my car over here, man. So <laughs> yeah. what do you guys do to open this? We use nice tools that we find around the house. Yeah. So um, today we have a spatula. It's not even a spatula, bro. A spoon, a big spoon. It's a spoon with holes in it. So I mean, whatever. What is that for? Spaghetti or what? 
All right, now. You guys are actually teaching people at home like a valuable lesson. Every time, you know how to use a different thing. There you go. We should get into it. All right, pass it down. Oh, okay. Give me your beer. There you go, sir. Thank you. I just realized this is a Jamaican beer. What if this is laced? <laughs> I hope it is. You can't trust the Jamaicans, man. All right, guys. Let's let's grab our glasses. What color do you think it's gonna be? I think it's gonna be like super light yellow. Super. Uh, I, it looks like it has a bunch of yeast in it. That's what. It yeah, looks it's like. like super foggy. Yeah, fog. There we go. That's the word I was looking could, for. I think I, I think it's gonna be green. I don't know why. I'm green? just gonna say it's gonna be a green. Oh uh, shit! That would be the first, guys. We did try red beers before. Oh, am oh, I right? Shit. This Damn. is like lemonade, bro. Bro, this does not look healthy at all. Lemonade up in here. Oh shit! Damn, dude, this looks like a this looks like Jamaica. This is not even a like, beer, dude. This is like what Jamaica, <laughs> the tap water in Jamaica. Dude, they just <laughs> turn it, they just turn it on there and they get. Oh my, man, is this All even right. a real beer? You guys messing with Colors? me? Is this like a joke? Smell test. Damn. Holy, holy, really holy God, come on. Man. I'm tasting this. What I would think you it's say the smell. It, it smells like it's gonna be good. Yeah, I mean it smells good. Smells like it's gonna be like soda. Some alcohol in it. Cheers, boys. Cheers. What does it smell like? It ginger? Smells like, it smells like ginger. It smells like ginger. <laughs> ginger. We don't it smells even like look. Jamaican piss. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Cheers. 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 bittersweet taste to it like once it comes in it tastes sweet but now that it's hitting my throat it's like a little spicy no yeah it's yeah it's spicy bro there you go that's the word i'm looking for spicy i don't know if the, do i have do you, do you guys finish this whole beer mm -hmm. <laughs> jesus <laughs> christ what about you rules initial impressions it's not a beer <laughs> that's why, that's the, the first the first thing that came to my mind. No, it is, it is spicy though. The more I drink into it's spicy, it. Spicy? That's nuts. I literally think this is tap water, guys. I don't think this is a... This is not a craft... Dude, they just threw stickers on and said, <laughs> here's a beer, dude. Threw some alcohol in it. I've had tea that tastes just like this without yeah. the fizzy thing. Without the beer tasting mm -hmm. in it? Which is kind of weird. No? I mean, it's weird, but I kind of like it. Like, I, I kind of, I would only drink one. But well, it's kind of interesting. Like at first, you get like this sweet, orangey flavor, and then like at the end, you get that little. Dude, pick. you're not even like three, three fourths down, dude. Like that spiciness, you know? Yeah, and you I get think, a, like the the ginger is the spicy. Like in your back of your mouth, going down your throat, you get the spiciness. Dude, my yeah. throat is burning right now. I feel like yeah. I just bit into like a something spicy. Yeah, Damn, this is. I think this was the wrong choice for me, man. I came on the wrong path. <laughs> I'm like, what is this? Well, let me ask you guys while we're drinking this. Like, this is by how, far the how often have you guys... Tasted something like this? Yeah. This is like our first time. This is actually a very unique, distinct beer. So when you guys do this, I, I get that you guys do a different beer every single episode, but mm -hmm. do you guys do like the name brands, like the Budweiser's, the oh, Miller? Oh, hell no, not really. So you guys do everything that's not like commercialized. You guys exactly. go into like crafted yeah, yeah, yeah. individual beer. Okay. Smaller, independent breweries. So out of all these brewers, what would you rank this one? The tasting out of all the ones you guys know so far. Yeah, it's kind of like something we do. So like on five, we give our rating. Yeah, oh, okay, yeah. okay, okay. With, with, with our fingers, pretty much. Yeah, okay, pull okay. It out, bam. Oh, that's and like the cool. reason we do it is because like we'll influence each other. Like, yeah, like, if I oh, say man, if I oh, say yeah, oh yeah. it tastes good, you're gonna be like damn, right. it kind of did taste. Good. Yeah, okay, I get you, guys. So let's fuck it. Let's go with the rating then, though. All right, let's, let's taste it a little bit. You guys bit. have to finish it, dude. We don't have to finish it. We gotta get a good amount <laughs> in. <laughs> yeah, we just like sip on it. My my throat is just burning right now. Dude. I don't know if I can finish this. I'm sorry, guys. But <laughs> Jesus, it's burnt. <laughs> Like for the for the viewers out there at home watching this, like our, my throat is burning right now. Like I need water. Like <laughs> Jesus. And hey, you feel like a man, bro. Cause like you don't like spicy things, right? I don't like spicy things, and I'm not a big uh, beer drinker. That's why I think this channel is, is really good because you're giving people like if they're ever in a bar or something, they see yeah, that Jamaican yeah, here. 
If you see that royal Jamaican, make sure you just toss it away because you do not need that in your life. Like, I like that. Honestly, it's just a five. So yeah. five, five being the best, one being the worst. Yeah, yeah. Yep. All right. One, two, three. Oh, oh, oh shit, one, damn. two, three. Wait, is that 1. like 1.5. Oh, 1.5. 1. 5. 1. 5. I had a two. I gave it a three. Really? Yeah. Do you like? Do you like spicy? I do like spicy things, but like not white? in your beer, right? No, not really my beer. Why'd you give it a, what was it? A two? A two. A two. A two. Yeah. I mean, honestly, like I said, I'm not much of a beer guy, but uh, within the last year, I've started actually drinking more beer. I started heavy and I started with Heineken. Okay. And the reason why Heineken, I was like, you know, first was because if you go out and stuff, three of them will get you ready, you know, turned on and you get, you know, pretty, it'll, it'll get you tipsy. And that's the reason I was like, the last beer that I have to take, the better. But lately, I've been a fan of Bud Light. I don't know why, but I don't know my taste buds have changed, but I can guarantee you guys this will not be pretty soon, like... It's probably your last time on the show. <laughs> <laughs> what do you, what, what's your... Okay, so let me ask you as a fan or as a first-time viewer of this and doing this live, okay. what's your favorite beer? Oh, we have a couple. We have to go back in those videos, but there's some that just... Like, what's your go-to beer? Like, let's say we, we go to a club or we go to a bar. They don't and have go-to beers. Yeah, it's like they're pretty low key. Okay, so you have to go to a specific brewery. But if you get, what's your go-to beer? Well, like my go-to beer at a bar, I would just say if I want something sweet, fucking Blue Moon. Blue Moon. Okay. Yeah, it's you know creamy, orangey, really freaking smooth. If I want something a little bit bitter, I'll just go with the, the Green Line. So what made you give this beer a 0.5? 1.5. 1.5. Um, that's pretty sweet. It's, it's sweet. That's that, that's it's super sweet. sweet. I feel like I'm drinking pop and it's can't do that. I'm pretty sure it has some sugar in it. A lot of sugar actually. Yeah. Oh yeah, it, it, does. it tastes yeah. like it does. So uh, I mean something fruity, something I would get probably maybe a girl that likes spicy things. What about you? Why'd you give it? Why'd I give it a three? Well, you know I'm a sucker for people that do something like truly different. Mm -hmm. And I mean like, when have you ever tasted a beer like this? Never. That, yeah. that I can tell you proudly, I've never tasted a beer like this. And or yeah. a beer. Oh, bless you. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Damn, bro. <laughs> and that was a fucking like. Jeez, dude. You put your heart into that shit. I was like, oh, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like they did something different. They took a shot. Fuck it, you know? Yeah. And you gotta appreciate that. Yep. Yep. I mean, I wouldn't drink it again, to be honest. I wouldn't buy this ever again in my life. <laughs> but going off of that, this is definitely a beer to try once. Just yep. because of its uniqueness. That's. I mean, I would definitely recommend this to try it once, but I won't ever drink it again. That's for sure. <laughs> Damn, <holy shit. laughs> yeah, dude. Hey, if you're sick, it hits you, this man. is the beer. This is it the hits you after. Uh, it's that after. <laughs> All right, so now let's connect it back to the Alpha Experience, boys. Okay. So it's excitement, laughter, freedom, friendship, and adventure. What does this beer fall under? Yeah, can I just like. When you tasted the beer, did any of those words come up? What are the words? He said it pretty fast. I didn't Excitement, catch. freedom, friendship, laughter, and adventure. Is it like more of an adventure? It's more, it's more of a laughter kind of beer. Out of all of those, I would say a laughter beer. Laughter? Why, why laughter? I don't know, that sort of that bittersweet taste is just like, it's funny to me because I'm like, you don't expect the beer to be, you know, you don't expect the beer to be spicy mm -hmm. like I don't go and say hey can I get the spiciest beer I usually say can I have you know a, cru uh, a crafts beer or can I have a domestic you never say hey what's the spiciest beer you guys have on the menu so <laughs> I think it's funny I mean from I mean if you guys even look into if you get a, if you get a closed zoom like like if you want to see this like there is a lion on the middle of this like when do you when would you ever see this ever I mean I think it's laughter I don't know about you guys but personally I think it's laughter yeah, I, I got, got mine. You got yours? Yeah. On three? One, two, three. Adventure. Excitement. All right. Nice. So you, you said adventure? excitement, you said what? Adventure. Adventure? Going okay. off of that, well, what he said, laughter, is like so, this beer is so crazy, so different. Uh, it just like, you drink it and you like, it's nothing like you ever drink before. You get the spiciness, the excitement goes up. You're like, holy shit, what is this? And you just, you know, feeling it. What about you? Yeah, like definitely, yeah. Just to piggy back off 
YouTube, man. Like, I think you gotta be like a little adventurous to try something out like this. And I, like, even though we didn't like it, I think there was like a lot of emotion when we were like reviewing it. You know, we we're like, holy fucking shit, what the fuck, you know? Yeah, from the color to the taste to the to yeah. the spiciness. Yeah, I mean the color. I don't know what you guys would consider this color, but I really think it's some dirty <laughs> tap water, like some dirty tap water. But hey. Yeah, Flint, Michigan, man. Shout out to Flint, Michigan. <laughs> We're drinking this water. I feel water, like people dude. die in Michigan. Like, shout out to Michigan. <laughs> All right, so any final <laughs> thoughts, feelings, emotions? Emotions. Any drink? final? Th okay, my final thoughts are: Do I have to keep drinking this beer, or can I toss it across the? Yeah, that's your final thought. You can toss it if you want. All right. Yeah, don't don't toss that glass though. <laughs> oh no no no! I will toss it. I toss the beer somewhere. somewhere. Good beer, good review. Plenty more to come, guys. Maybe we'll see we'll show you guys here once he upgrades from Budweiser. Well, that, that piss. <laughs> no, I would say but, next uh, time you bring me, please do not let it be the Jamaican Royal or Royal Jamaican. Next time we bring you, we'll bring you the hardest fucking shit we can find. I, I hope. We have, we have the, we know of this beer called the, it's a myth. It's the watermelon beer. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you might not drink it. <laughs> Why? It messes them up? You won't mess anybody up. <laughs> it like, like, a four, like a four locos? Yes, what is it? What is it? Four like percent? It's like 12 percent. Beer? Yeah. Yeah, but we'll, we'll do something heavy next time. I mean, for, for this being the first time I'm on the on your channel, I, I want to say thank you guys for bringing me along. Um, thank you for letting me taste shitty beer. And, <laughs> and That's how we do it. Day. It's like, yeah, you're welcome. You're welcome. And I do, and I do want to say, I mean, we're we're acting like there's nothing. Like we're acting like this background's not here. But as you guys can see, we have three cars behind us. I think it's pretty dope the setting you guys have going on. And yeah, thank you. And once again, if you guys made it, you know, to this part of the video and you watched this whole review, uh, down below, my boy Ruzan put my link. Go ahead, check it out, and you can see the behind the scenes of this. Oh, yeah. yeah. Awesome. Thank you for coming. Thank you, bud. Thank you, sir. All right, dude. You have a good. You have a good one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, if you're a consumer, Peace out, motherfuckers. Oh, that shit tasted bad. <laughs>